Welcome to this personalized hypnosis session where we're going to try and quickly refresh you and make you feel ready for the year ahead. Thank you so much for joining me and throughout if you just keep an open mind and try your very best to tune out everything else around you. I know that sometimes that can be a little bit tricky, but if you can just do your best, that is always good enough. Now, Wherever you are at this current moment in time, I want you to take a moment to find a nice place that's just for you. Now depending on where you are, this could be if you're at home, your bedroom, perhaps if you're taking a quick break at work, this could be the staff room, or perhaps even a little stationary cupboard, but just anywhere that you can just find your own little space. I'll just give you a moment to do that. Don't worry if you can't find anywhere. Perhaps you're travelling, Perhaps you're surrounded by many, many people. In which case, all you need to do is to create that space but in your mind. So, there's no need to rush and find somewhere physical. You're always going to have that little safe space right in your mind. Just to give you a little longer though just in case you are finding somewhere physical, that's fine. Take your time, it's all about you. Now I'm going to presume that you've found somewhere, and if not, you've got that space in your mind all secured. And don't worry, even if you have got this physical space, I don't expect you to be able to tune everything out instantly. Things like this take time, but hopefully in this quick session today, we're going to be able to do a little bit of mind resetting, and that will start you on the path and journey to rest and relaxation and reassurance. Now what I'd like you to do is I'd like you to start and recognize your breathing. When we're doing any form of meditation, whether that be within ourselves, a guided meditation or a hypnosis, we want to take the time to focus on our breathing. Now there are a few different breathing techniques that you can do. I'd like you to try this one as I personally find it very effective. So what I'd like you to do is place one hand just on your upper chest, just here, and one hand on your stomach. And what I'd like you to do is I'd like you to breathe in, and as you do so, I want you to push your stomach out. Now this is almost reverse breathing. And it will feel a little bit strange to start with. And when you exhale, I want you to draw your stomach back in. This makes us feel very connected with ourselves. And in this moment, that's exactly what we want to do. So I do it with you now. If we inhale, pushing that stomach out and inhale, sorry, exhale, and draw our stomachs in. Inhale, push out, 
exhale, push in. Perfect. I want you to try and subtly do this breathing throughout. Again, if you find this too much, that's absolutely fine. Just try and keep your breathing nice and controlled and slow and steady. And realize there's no place for any fast breathing during this session. Just nice, slow and considered breaths in and breaths out. Good. Now, what I'd like you to do is I'd like you to simply be okay with this moment, with you just sitting, standing, wherever you are, recognizing that you deserve to feel refreshed. You deserve to feel renewed. And as we begin the calendar year, it's a really good time to reset ourselves. Now we speak about New Year's resolutions and often this can be a point of pressure and that's not what we want to do. What we want to do instead is we want to try and think of ways where we can feel better and that doesn't have to be getting into fitness, eating healthier, trying a new hobby. It may simply be that you want to introduce little things into your everyday to make yourself feel good. Maybe that's taking the time to have an extra long hot shower at the end of the day or a nice warm bath. Maybe it's saving up just a little bit of pocket money to treat yourself to that favourite top you've had your eye on in the shops. Or maybe it's something as simple as catching up with a friend Whatever these things are, I'd like you to take a moment to try and think of three things. Just three. There's no pressure within this moment. And this isn't about setting goals. This is about thinking about ways where you can feel better. Because you deserve to feel renewed and refreshed, don't you? and you will. And by thinking of these three very simple things, very simple changes, you can begin the change for yourself. And again, these are things that do not require a lot of effort. I don't want you feeling stressed or pressured. I want you feeling relaxed and calm. And when you have these three things in your mind, I want you to ask yourself a question. Why haven't I been taking this time for myself before? I really want you to ask yourself that question. Because when you do, you start to think, why? Why really? Have I just been too tired at the end of the day? Have I not focused enough on myself? Do I not deserve that little bit extra self-love? And I think sometimes that's something that we forget ask ourselves, do we deserve that extra bit of attention and love? And the answer is always yes. And I know this can be a tricky mindset to get into. It's very, very easy 
to get into patterns. And when we get into these patterns, they can be hard to break. But the blessing of a new year gives us an excuse to try to just reset those patterns. And you deserve to feel refreshed and you deserve time for you, don't you? I want you to repeat after me, I deserve me time. I deserve me time. I deserve me time. And I want you to think of this phrase in your mind whenever you find yourself questioning those little things that you're doing for yourself. There is no reason why you don't deserve all of those little changes and those little things that are dedicated just to you. We can take so much time thinking of others and within this time we lose ourselves a little bit. And with the pressure of work, school, college and other stresses that life likes to throw away, we can find ourselves questioning whether our time is best spent helping others and focusing on those life stresses or whether actually we can afford to take the time for ourselves but you deserve that time I want you to repeat after me I deserve time for me I deserve time for me I deserve time for me and you really really do I know that it can feel a little uncomfortable when we take a moment to think about ourselves it can feel a little selfish can't it it can feel a little self-indulgent but the good news is, is that self-love is self-indulgent, but in the best way. You're not harming anyone, and you're simply taking the time to show your mind and your body that you care about yourself. And I know that can be a really difficult phrase for some to say, but I want you to try and repeat after me. I care about myself. I care about myself. I care about myself. And that is okay to say and it's okay to feel. We spend so long caring about others that often we forget to tell ourselves that we care and that is so important. There is nobody like you on this planet. You are completely unique like a star in the sky and there is no one who can offer and bring to the world what you bring. And I know as you're in this moment right now, you may be apprehensive of the year ahead. You may be feeling stressed. You may be feeling anxious. You may be not looking forward to the year ahead for many different reasons. And that is okay. But in this moment, everything is fine and I think you can handle this year a lot better than you think. 
and by taking these moments of calm, of self-reflect and of self-care, you can start to get everything else in proportion. Because really nothing is as bad as it seems and everything is temporary and that's something very, very important to remember. Things that are negative are temporary and equally things that are positive can be temporary, which is why we need to learn to live in the moment and sometimes pop those phones and technology pieces away and just be in that moment, just like you're being present right now. You are going to have an amazing year and even though you may question that and you may be thinking, no I'm not, or why, or I haven't got many things planned and your brain may be filling with these negative thoughts already, just at the simple idea that you're going to have a good year. But you're already taking such a positive step. And after this session, you are already going to feel a little bit better. And every time we do this, and every time you take the time for yourself, you create a space in the year where you're feeling a little better and that's all it takes for a good event to happen, a build up of little good moments. And when you reflect at the end of the year, you'll be able to see that growth from now to then. And you'll see how much you've grown and it doesn't matter what material things or physical things your year is filled with. All that matters is that you continue to try and you continue to do your best. And that is all anyone can ask. And that's all you can ask of yourself. Now I want you to repeat after me. My best is good enough. My best is good enough. My best is good enough. And that is a phrase that I really want being in the forefront of your mind. A phrase that I continually like to share with you is comparison is the thief of joy. And when we start to compare ourselves to others, we start to lose a little bit of our own joy. Have you ever been in a situation where you felt so happy and positive and then you've seen what someone else is doing and your own joy is sucked away because you feel like this person has more? And that is always the trouble with life. There will always be someone technically with more and there will always be someone with less. And the more we compare ourselves, the more we lose a little bit of ourself. So I don't want you to compare yourself this year. You do not need to compare yourself to anyone. So repeat after me, I do not need to compare myself to anyone. I do not need to compare myself to anyone. I do not need to compare myself to anyone. 
and truly you really really don't you are enough and you don't need to compare yourself to anyone you are already absolutely smashing this year just by taking this one moment to focus on yourself to better yourself to zone out and tune out to take the time to focus on you and what you need because you are amazing and you deserve all of the chances and all of the happiness that everyone else does and everyone who puts in that work will see results it is all down to you and your mind and your mind is so much more powerful than you even realize you are such a strong and powerful individual and you have got everything you need every single tool in the box to have not only an amazing year but just an amazing life and whilst that may sound pretty big scale why shouldn't you? and that's always something that we should question whenever you doubt yourself ask yourself why are you not capable enough do you not have everything and all the qualities that are needed and all these doubts are just so ineffective and they're such a waste of time all that negative thinking all that negative energy it's all a waste of time time that you could be putting into feeling positive and manifesting that good energy and that's something that we talk about a lot manifesting good energy but what does that mean all it means to me is focusing on the good focusing on the little positives of every day not spending time delving into negative thoughts and the more we look upon things in a positive light the more likely we are to attract positivity into our lives in the future and again I know this may be met with self-doubt and that is okay this is a learning curve we all continue to learn and grow and no one has all the answers but the main thing is is that you are taking this time this very moment for you to grow to adapt to learn to feel better to feel stronger to feel more empowered and you're doing exactly that right now you are a strong individual and you need to be reminded that you are amazing and I want you to say that with me now I am amazing I am amazing I am amazing and I want you to believe that believe this positivity believe in this moment because this is where things start to turn around start to change and you start to grow as an individual positive things are coming your way good things are coming your way good energy is coming your way all because you're taking this moment this precise moment to work on yourself to refresh yourself 
to learn new habits, to grow, to change in a positive light, to reduce all of that self-doubt, to reduce that feeling of stress, to reduce that feeling of pressure. Why do we put pressure on ourselves? Why do we choose to make ourselves feel stressed? We can choose to not feel stressed. And I want you to repeat that with me now. I can choose to not feel stressed. I can choose to not feel stressed. I can choose to not feel stressed. And that is what this is all about. It's a choice. You are choosing how you want to feel. You are choosing at this very moment how you would like your year to go. And I think we both know that you want things to go well. You want positive changes. You want to feel refreshed, renewed, because you deserve to. You want this to be your year. You want to feel better. You want to feel stronger. You want to feel like the best version of yourself. And why shouldn't you? There is no way that this year is not going to go the way that you want it to go if you start putting in these positive practices. You start to gain that self-belief. You start to recognise that you are amazing. You start to realise that you don't need to compare. You start to learn that taking those small moments of self-care can have such a positive, wide effect on things. Learning that it's not selfish or self-indulgent. Learning that it's okay to do little things to make you happy. It's okay to care about others, but you also need to care about yourself. It's okay to say no to stress and no to pressure. It's okay to step away from toxic situations and toxic people. It's okay to think positively and invite positivity into your life. And it's okay that you're just doing this now. Because whenever you start, that is the moment that you're choosing. And you're choosing a better way of thinking. And I think that is amazing. I think you are amazing. And I think that with all of these beginning tools, you are going to have such a positive month and a positive year ahead. And just recognise that even if you find it difficult to start with, you deserve to feel good and you will feel renewed. So finally, I want you to take a moment. I want you to feel a little more present. I want you to place the hand on your upper chest and on your stomach. I want you to do three nice breaths for me. So inhale and exhale. Inhale and exhale, inhale, and exhale, good, I want you to bring yourself back, I want you to feel refreshed, I want to thank you for taking this time to work on yourself, and I want you to know that I will always, always be here for you, whenever you need to return to this, whenever you need to remind yourself of how amazing you are and how positive things can be, I will be here. 
Thank you so much for listening. Thank you for being present with me. And I really hope you have an amazing year just like you deserve. Thank you so much.